Hi, on this episode of Poptography, we're going to take Princess Leia, number 228, and the Biker Scout, number 234, with their speeder bikes, and we're going to create this image. And welcome to Poptography. My name is Patrick, and today we're going behind the scenes of the Princess Leia speeder bike number 228 image I just recently shot. So how we did that is we grabbed our two Funko Pops that, again, I'd recently completed the collection of the uh, indoor speeder bikes after I just picked up both Luke Skywalker and Ewok on their respective speeder bikes from Tony from Star Wars Sith. So I haven't been kind of excited about that. And I was working on a video highlighting all of the speeder bikes that I've collected and I completed the collection. <clears throat> I decided to do an image. So the first is I grabbed this great image, uh, a woodsy image backlit um, from Adobe stock that I thought would work perfect for my indoor background. Then I put both the pops on the set. And this time what I did is I kind of uh, did it a, where I usually kind of set them up on a piece of foam so I can get them at the right height. This time I extended the foam longer so I'd be able to put two of these obviously larger kind of pop rides or speeder bikes in the shot. Um, but I also wanted to create that depth where we can get Princess Leia kind of breaking that wall coming right towards the lens uh, and this guy still giving chase. So I was able to do that by just kind of placing them on a longer, on the foam kind of going long ways. Um, and I had the room to be able to do that and still have my backdrop as my virtual volume. So I had all the space, had all the depth I needed, then it was building the light after that. So one other thing before I built the light is I did add some playing cards under each of them just so I could tilt them up just a little bit so I can get the front ends of their speeders. Um, so they weren't kind of going into the, the ground, if you will, um, from the camera angle of shooting. So that was another little thing I did to kind of cheat them. Then for the lights, um, I used five light loom cube setup this time. But I started with my main light diffused on a globe, 45 degrees. You can see that hitting Princess Leia, the catch light right in her eyes. And I really want to kind of get that as the main light to focus on and build around that. So to create that situational lighting from that backdrop, I took another, my second loom cube, didn't put any barn doors or diffusion on that and turned it up very brightly to kind of really kind of, as you can see, add all that rim, highlight and spill light coming from the back, which really gives us situational lighting of our backdrop. The third light I added a loom cube diffused with a globe on the top. And I had that kind of space in between so I could get both of the helmets and some detail uh, coming out of that. My fourth loom cube, I wanted to add just a little bit something more to the biker scout. Uh, he was too much in shadow, so I put the fusion in on a snoot and was able to spot him and kind of get his chest area lit up a little bit more. And then for my fifth and final loom cube, I came uh, from the opposite, that right side, and I just wanted to add a nice little rim se separation, but more of a, a dappled light, so where you can kind of see it wrapping here on Princess Leia's right side there, as well as it hits the biker scout. So it adds a little something, gives them more dimension. We then brought this image into Photoshop, and from here, we just played with uh, you, saturation, and I did do one other little thing. Because of the distance and I was focused on Princess Leia, I did do like a, what we would call a focus stack. So I did do two images where I focused on the Biker Scout. So I was able to blend that in to the image of Princess Leia. So I could get um, both of them pretty much, not not in total sharpness, uh, just enough that I could pull out some more detail on him. And so it wasn't as blurred uh, from being behind Leia. Then I just added a, uh, a blaster coming from the Biker Scout speeder. And that's how we created this image. So if you enjoyed this content today, please hit the like, definitely hit the subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification bell 
so you don't miss the next episode of Poptography. Until then, may the force be with you.